Yo, Hello, chefs of the making. making. Welcome back to Legendary Adventures. My name is Eli, aka the Big Sauce Gamer Tag. And I'm Becky, aka Small Fry. Squad. I mean, oh my goodness. <gasps> oh my god! Just you know, go. There, there go are there are days that you wake up and it, it, it it's Christmas. It just happens to be Christmas. And today, uh, this day in November, you know, we woke up to the most wonderful news. News that we were waiting for to uh, to drop yes. in our laps for for this whole entire year. The, or the more longer than the, that. The speculations of, yes. of it in itself. And, and where do we even begin? Well, before we dive in, don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and turn that notification bell on. So you can be notified of Pokemon Go news, Pokemon Go vlogs, Pokemon Go raid counter guides, the perfect IV, uh, Pokemon 4, Pokemon Spotlight Hours, and of course, community tips, and so much more. Yes. But with that said, let's dive in. The news today that we got to bring to you, and there's a lot, so, yeah. so hang in there. Yes. The, bring your snacks, your popcorn, <laughs> get ready, because this is so much information, guys. First and foremost, level 50 has been officially, officially announced with a start date. So Woo! let's get into that. Level 50 right. has been the long-awaited item for, for all us trainers that have been able to achieve level 40. All the OGs, all everyone who, who from day one or even later on got into the game and grinded, grinded it, it and out. did the hardcore grind. It, you were the individuals who did all the Pidgey evolutions, who, who went ahead and did the gym takeovers, the raiding, and all the friendship bonuses, and ran your lucky eggs. I mean, it worked. Everything and anything from, from quest lines to go ahead and get your evolutions into just everything to okay. get you to get to that level 40, and then once, twice, three, four times over, and then more. Bam, 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 bam. Yes, let's get let's talk a, a little bit about that for the players that have reached level 40 like a million times over. Leveling up is going to be like an even playing field for everyone. It doesn't really matter if, how much XP you have, you're gonna be able to grind it out for level 50. Okay, so with that coming to uh, to the details in itself is that we are entering the level formats of which case there'll be task lines and quest items that you have to go ahead and complete in order to go ahead and achieve that level based item. Perks here from level 40 to level 50. Now your XP will still be, you know, showcased in in your gamer tag, your your little your gamer, gamer bio, yeah, portfolio is what I was gonna say. But yes, um, so the world can see how many times over you've already hit it over via XP. But to go ahead and, and, and achieve the level the levels, you, you got to put in the work. A right. whole new way to play, and I'm excited for this because it yes. makes Pokemon Go fresh again. Now, fam, beginning November 30th worldwide is when we're gonna be able to dive into you know being able to acquire that level 50. This also means that there's gonna be a change up in how you get more XP. Uh, XP base being uh, for the items of hatching eggs, Catching, the raids, just everything. Everything. Now, if you happen to be, well, you know, uh, a, a fellow legendary trainer out in Australia, well, kudos to you because many, yes. many trainers actually, as of today, are gonna be able to go ahead and start partaking in 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 going for level 40 and above. So kudos to you. Let us know down in the comments uh, for all our fam and that's out in that area to to see how it's going. If you were one of the lucky ones, how, how does it feel? Because there's a lot of things that go in with changing the level 40, like you know, leveling up your Pokemon, higher tiers, and we'll get into that in a minute. Right. But you also wanted to go ahead and share another item yes, too. Yes. So if uh, for all the trainers that le that reach level 40 before December 31st of this year, 2020 you will be able to get the title of Legacy 40 Trainer. Which so is that's so sure. dope. So talk about a big motivation to go ahead and really go hard for this last, well, about 40, Two months? 40 days. I mean, we're like it's a month and a half or yeah. before the end of the year. That's to true. really push for it, to, to really go after, uh, after it. I mean, with, you know, a community day still ahead of us, and then the, the community day uh, to come, December, the spotlight yeah. hours. I mean, there's so many events, plus everything else that's about to be announced here that, you know, there's there's XP out there to get, fam, that you can definitely do it. And, and then this is a special shout out to all our non-level 40 trainers that, that rock with us here. We see you. Fam, if you need that help to go ahead and do the- The raids. The raids. The battles, just anything that, that gets you XP. Yes. Send us the invites. Send yeah, us the invites. Let we us will know. Help you push yeah. To get there. And we will send the invites to you guys as well. Just drop your gamer code down below. Now let's talk about the catch XP bonus that's live from November 18th, 1 p.m. all the way to December 31st, 1 11 59 p.m. Today. local time. Okay. So to reach level 40, Niantic decided to give us a two times catch XP bonus. 
I'm excited. I'm excited because, I mean, this this is going to be a push. I mean, yes, granted, we're level 40 already, but we love catching and watching little XP bar go up. So, I mean, for all you fam that are still on the way to working uh, to level 40, Lulu, Kels, we, can, we see you. We see you, fam. Vincent, we see you. And we want to help yeah, you all those get... lucky eggs, man. We, we, we want to help you all <laughs> to, to get there. So, of course, you know, make sure you're all catching. This is a perfect time that if you have your Go Plus, you know, restock up on all the Pokeballs as you can and just catch away. Catch, catch, catch away. On top of that, trainers, you're going to be able to power up your Pokemon to an even higher level. So the CP cap has been raised. So all those Pokemon that have been previously maxed out are no longer maxed out anymore. You're gonna be um, having to throw in that Stardust to max those Pokemon out again. Now, this does change up the item in itself because in order to go ahead and raise them from the level 40 to the higher 50 cap in itself, you actually need to be using a different type of candy. Now, this is something that everyone has always wonder what, what what do you do with all that you know candies that you have right. for you know perhaps your rat the pony toss you know all these pokemon that you've been catching for years well now you can go ahead and be able to convert them over to what's it called candy xl which is going to be awesome because not only are you going to be able to convert your candies there's going to be ways to go ahead and acquire them later on so that you can go ahead and of course give that boost to to the pokemon that you want to get up to level 50. now for my trainers that are out in australia right now that are partaking in this event right now as we speak do note that well you'll be able to go ahead and power up your pokemon and rock them up to that level 50 cap as you level up you will only be able to drop them off in gyms for the time being as a flex you won't be able to use them in pvp um or in raiding just as an fyi just because uh you know they, they're still trying to get, uh, maintain balance uh, for us while we go ahead and have the best of everything in the coming days. Now, do note that, that each level uh, will have a, a set of tasks too for, for you to go ahead and complete. Whether it tests your skill of catching, whether it's a situation of evolving. Um, Look, you know. every little function of Pokemon Go will be tested from you getting to level 40 to level 50, whether it be raiding, whether it be the grunts, the shadow grunts, and uh, catching all these Pokemon. I mean, everything Buddies. everything is going to be tested and you are going to be doing research checks out in the wild and just so much more. Now, we do have a little sample here of what, you know, level 46 requirements look, but it is subject to change. But, you know, just no, so you, get, just, yeah, you just, have an idea. You have an idea of what it looks like and what to look forward to. As you can see, some of them, or it's 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 not something you can just completely blow out of the water in a single day. Not that you couldn't do it, but you know, if you if you mm. want to savor it, go ahead and do so. You know, there's no wrong way to get to level 50 as long as you enjoy enjoy the journey there. All right, and so on top of that, we are getting another friendship event kicking off today, actually. Okay. So it is going to be the 12 days of friendship, 1 p.m. to November 30th at 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. One of the bonuses of the 12 day friendship is that you're going to be able to increase your friendship higher. Level, and yeah, faster. faster. Actually, actually, faster is what I'm trying to say. You're going to get to acquire it faster. Um, throw Which gifts trading and of course battling which is amazing because you do want to get your friendship all the way to best friends to get that xp bonus and throw up the lucky egg and maybe coordinate and just do a massive xp game right. with the friendship uh, event right now so and of course and because it's a friendship event you are going to be able to open more gifts yeah on a daily so, so that's always a plus that is always a plus i love opening up gifts i'm sad when i don't see gifts in my inventory so Please send those gifts over if you guys are on our friends list. All right, trainers. And if that wasn't enough, let's face it. We're all here Woo! to go ahead and collect and, and, and complete the fulfillment of our Pokédex. Now, with that said, we actually have new Pokémon being introduced yes. into the game from... From the Kalos region. And you can expect to see them in Pokémon GO starting off December 2nd, 10 a.m. to December 8th, 10 p.m. your local time zone. Which, of course, will be appearing more in the wild is what, what we mean okay, by that. Okay, who can we see in the wild then? With the Kalos Pokemon coming to the game in itself, we are looking at, the, of course, the starters, which is Chespian, Fennekin, and, of course, Froki, which, of course, you're going to get the ev evolutions of them. So I'm excited, really, because we're going to get Ninja finally in the game. Yes. So I'm very excited for that. Then, of course, Bulby, then, of course, uh, Dick Tall and Flame. Uh, and course. there's going to be all these Pokemon also in the Egg Bowl. So we're excited to see all the Pokédex entries and that we're going to be more, able more, to get. More. Yes. Then of course there is a new region being introduced, which is going to be uh, Clefexi uh, for for the France region. So another reason to travel once everything is safe in the world. Um, and of to course, go get and, that Dex entry. And of course trade. You know. So I'm very excited for this. Very very excited. Now. 
there is another item in itself to go ahead and announce that when this kicks off, we're gonna get a new mysterious raid egg. A, a tier one. one. A tier one. So something that everyone can can acquire, but I mean, I'm, I'm excited. We don't know what yeah. the full details is. We're just being, you know, told that there's something something delicious coming. So we're waiting. We're waiting. But if that wasn't it, there is still more, 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 more. So on top of all this information and news that we have, I mean, oh my goodness. All right. So we have literally a changing of the season situation. Literally. And now we we knew from speculations that uh, once we got Deerling, and when of course once we got the quest line in itself, that we were going to be able to have, you know, that something was coming. That something was going to come because Deerling is a Pokemon that can go ahead and uh, be found on its different variants and, and the changing of seasons. Right. So with that said. Pokemon Go is finally going to go ahead and have a changing of seasons in the game, not only from, you know, the backgrounds and all that item based on weather, but the fact of Pokemon that are going to be appearing in Northern and Southern Hemispheres based on the, the seasons. seasons. Yes, so, so it's going to be a change every three months, and there's also going to be events tied to the seasons. So everything is going to be themed out according to the season. Which uh, which is dope Which is dope, because, I mean, what better to go ahead and, like, have wintertime and see you know ice snow based uh, pokemon you know uh, in in your in your region i mean that's going to be great you know it's summer you're going to see all all the sunny uh, pokemon that go ahead and benefit from being out in the sun it, it's going to be phenomenal i mean i'm excited yes. to this so on top of that they're also going to be putting different mega evolved pokemons according to the season that's actually gonna be cool because I mean, let's face it. You know, if it's springtime, I can see Venusaur coming in. Again, full speculation on this. You know, it's summertime. Uh, the Charizards will be more appearing. Uh, this way that you're focused on, you know, acquiring those candies during that time frame. And then of course, it gives us an incentive to really focus on doing the task lines for uh, to get, you know, the Mega Energy just in general. Yeah, so, it's gonna be awesome to see the rotation of all the Pokemon. Let's very just, much so. Yeah, it's not gonna be so like ball like every single time. A burnout you know? or the, yeah, too many in there out. that we don't know what's popping out. So this is gonna be great. This is actually not a bad way to go ahead and keep us still like interested and of course chasing down those Pokemon. Correct. All right. Now the other change up, the other change up that this one was like completely rocked me in regards to it. Um, kudos to, uh, to all your fans who already reached rank 10 and those who are still working on it. Hang in there. You, you, this is this is the season to do so because guess what? We're going to change in bat in and go battle. I mean, yeah, we, we're going to go from from having 10 ranks to 24 ranks. Whoa. Bam, so this is gonna be a slow ramp up to go ahead and get yourself to become the elite of the elite. Right. Then on, on top of this, we're also gonna be experiencing, you know, four different quadrants in, in, in regards to to the making it to the final four. Yeah, uh, so, the, so the top four ranks are gonna have special badges according to those ranks, because those are gonna be like the top of the top of the ranks. So looking forward to seeing you all in there and hopefully myself and you. Yeah, so the first season is going to kick off December 1st, 2020 at 8 a.m. local time zone. So be ready on that time to see the, the complete change. It's going to be a complete change up. So excited for all the new changes coming to so Pokemon much, Go. So much info and of course, uh, fam, uh, we will keep you posted with all new details that are coming in regards to, the, to this alt. And of course, we will send you all in the next Legendary Adventures. Peace. Peace.